Alright, good morning, Madden 25 Gamers. Today's video, we're going to feature our X Factor formation here uh, from the Shotgun Snugs in the New Orleans Playbook. This formation is going to allow us to be man and zone and blitzes, all of the above. Alright, Shotgun Snugs, um, play begins and ends. Uh, play we're going to come back, come out in every single time is going to be the Saints spot shape. Alright, uh, real quick, uh, we're going to, no hot routes on this play, and the first read is always going to be the wheel route to uh, Woods there. And real quick, I want to show you the man reads. So the first read is always actually going to be CJ Spiller on the backfield, and you see that's a really good route. Uh, he gets like a little speed burst to the outside there. It's really effective. Second read is going to be Woods on that deep wheel route. You see it's going to get good separation against man. And maybe put some extra yards on after catch. The third read uh, is going to be Goodwin. And at this point, he'll be breaking over to the left side there. And then the other two reads really aren't that great. Um, I like to zig Johnson because it's another man read. I don't like him on that deep route. I only like to have one deep route. So you'll see here, his, his route beats man. The only problem is the stupid... The stupid spot shake route will sometimes get in the way for no reason, but it's just the way the game works. Um, not a whole lot we can do about it, but you see it gets pretty good separation against man. Um, and then lastly, the deep post to Graham uh, is going to get pressed with a snap of the ball. Uh, pass lead down to the inside, you can click on and make a user catch, but a lot of times you'll get hit sticks, so I don't recommend throwing that unless you're in zone. Okay. So that's that, um, and then I want to look at the play halfback option. What we do out of this is we like to motion Graham to the right here, put him on a drag. Alright, so something like this right here. Our first read is going to be uh, Graham on the drag against zone. He's a great option. He'll be open every time. Alright. Against man, we also will still look to Graham. He will also beat man as well, which is kind of nice. As you see that right there. Did you see that? Maybe you didn't see that. But his man is all the way on the other side of the formation. Okay, so basically you could put him on a zig route. And if they're in man coverage and he's on a zig instead of a drag, he's still going to beat zone. Apologize for my controller effing up. Kind of like my mouth feels right now. But if he's in a zig, he still will beat zone the same way, but you see he's even more effective against man. Alright. Oh, so that's that play. Um, and then, also, that's that's just the first read. Um, the route to Woods is very effective against a max pressure defense, like something like this, where the deep ball will kill it over the top. And I don't know what it is with the Raiders, but they just get deep for some reason. But most, it, I'm telling you, in game you'll be fine. Uh, if they're cover zero blitzing you, um, this play becomes a really good option. So here we'll look at, and then uh, Johnson's route. Uh, it's a it's a user catch like that or the top. I don't recommend it against man. Um, and then lastly, we have the corner route to Goodwin. Uh, pass lead down to the outside, gonna beat man coverage, been beat man all year. So that's the HB option. Got the halfback draw for, you know, the max coverage defenses. And then, um, oh man. Then we also have the PA Saints cross play. Um, this is one of my favorite plays. I like to block the running back. And we like to put Johnson here. We like to leave him on the angle streak. Uh, against man, our first read is going to be Woods here. See, it's going to get really good separation against man. Now, also, I forgot to to mention, we like to motion Goodwin out to the sidelines here. Okay? And then, um, our second read is going to be the deep post route to Johnson. Basically, if you throw it, like, as he's doing his double move, it will beat man. So here we'll just get an example. Right there. It will actually be man-man. But where it's, not, where it's really good. Is again when they're cover zero blitzing you. His route. Will 
And again, you got to have a little bit more time there. Unfortunately, I don't know what was going on with the with the blocking, but if he has time, he just kills. Like that was cover four, and you know he's gonna get open. I don't know what it is, but it's very effective. And what will happen? So like, if they're covers zero blitzing you, and they usually won't blitz you with eight. But you know, here we're gonna send six at the quarterback. And we'll be able to pick it up with this blocking system. And you'll see this pass lead that lob that over the top, and you can get some separation. But again, Raiders are like super glitchy. I don't know why. Um, and then our third read is going to be the out route to Graham. We've been seeing that beat man all year long. Just pass lead to the outside, you'll be fine. And you see there, beats man. Then our last read on the play is going to be the deep um, corner route to Goodwin. And again, against man, it's pretty effective. He will get bumped, but that's actually a good thing. As you see the separation. What is up with dang Raider, Raiders, man? Huh. Um, if you, if you, and I've ran into that a couple times before this, so if, if that happens... Then I would say snap before he sets. So something like right here. And now you can user catch it. Or what you could do. Is leave him. In tight. And that was like in zone there. But against man. Pass lead down into the outside. On this play. Right there. And there you see there is the separation. Alright, so that's the Snugs, that's the X-Factor. Remember, we can do all the basic stuff we've always done out of Snugs with the Motion Snap to Graham and, and all the other stuff we've done before against the Tight. Uh, now we add the Saint Spot Shake, and this is just barely scratching the surface of all you can do with the Snugs. Uh, for more information on the Snugs, Snugs, if you will please check out Forward Progress Madden's YouTube channel. This is his offense that he runs uh, almost all the time out of the Snugs formation. So hopefully this provides some insight into one of the most effective Snugs formations in Mountain 25. And check out Zan's channel for more information on how to run it. Thanks for your time today. Hopefully you enjoy the New Orleans scheme and we'll hop into gameplay for you soon.